Police emergency, what's the emergency? Hello, uh, I'm 87 years old and I've been called down to my son's flat by his neighbours. The door's open and everything's all over the place. And what's his name? Gavin. They saw him on Saturday, but they haven't seen him since. He's very vulnerable because of his schizophrenia. Anybody could attack him, but he wouldn't turn to fly. I am very protective of Gavin because of his problems. I can be there for him, but I can't sort it out. If it is Gavin that's at the service station, it's a very isolated place. There's nowhere to stay, there's no cover, and it's on the M1, a busy motorway. So there's obviously the concerns. If he's there through the night, he could come to harm. Are you all right? Uh, We're looking for a missing person. The first time I saw him, he didn't have a top on or anything. What, nothing? Just no, complete? He was just buying like random things. Like what? Like torches. He bought a, a yellow jacket. Yeah, yeah. Loads and loads of cigarettes. Yeah. Just random I mean, things to the point where I just stopped serving him. I'm like, you don't need all this. Yeah. Did he yeah. say what he needed it for? No. What was he wearing when you last when you last yeah, saw him? Uh, a brown leather jacket. A brown leather yeah. jacket, right. Okay. But well, thank you for thank the information. You for yeah. When I heard that this male was buying uh, random things, spending money, it's obviously worrying. So if that is Gavin, um, my concerns are growing because it sounds like he's very vulnerable. He uh, took his lump sum from his pension and he's more or less bought it. And do you know any of his other friends or anything like that? He's hooked up with her, he's gone really down here. What do you know about her, if anything? Mm, I don't know, I've only seen her once. Right. So do you know how much money he's got in his bank account now? Not a lot at the moment. Not a lot. Like I said, he had 40,000 last year and most of that's got... We'll see, he's got an extra £6,000 bank loan. Have you ever mentioned, like, he'd been buying anything for her or yeah. anything like that? What's he bought? Two cars. A BMW one, I think, a Vauxhall. The thing is, that considering it's really been, they've only known each other a month, and he's bought two cars. That's what he's like. Yeah. He wants to buy things, sort of thing. He's clearly really yeah. vulnerable, though, if he's going oh, to buy yeah. people's oh, cars. Yeah. yeah. Gavin is an adult, and... He can give gifts to people, but it's just making sure that he's making that choice on his own and he's got the capacity to make these choices. This comes a bit of a line of being kind and taking advantage of as well. There he is. Yeah. Seeing him on the CCTV, it's a bit of relief to know he's alive, but doesn't seem OK. He doesn't look to me like he'd been looking after himself. And is that your last camera that yeah. we're tracking? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. He's got this friend that he's bought some cars for. We really need to get the information about these cars, about this friend. Please, love. Gavin. Gavin, we've been a bit worried about you. Have you just got back just now? Yeah, I've just got back now. Been away, stranded out on a most way services for two weeks. Have you? With no money, I've had no treat for two weeks. Have it's you not? Morty, yeah. Go inside and have a chat. Is that yeah, okay? Yeah, you're yeah, not yeah, in yeah, any trouble. Fine. We just want to make you? sure you're okay. No, it's a bit of a relief physically seeing someone that you know has been missing for a long time, and for them to just appear in front of you is quite rare as well. Usually we're running around after people and locate them somewhere rather than them come to you. It was good seeing his face. <laughs> yeah. What's your relationship like? Has she got a couple of your cars or something? I, I uh, bought one for myself and I didn't want it. OK. It's a too much insurance. Yeah. So I give it her and she's paying me weekly and I bought her another car. Oh, she's paying me weekly for How come you're buying them for her to then pay you back weekly? Can she's she... my best friend. Right, OK. Can she not yeah. afford it, just...? No. Right. 
He's not actually known that he's gone missing. He's just sort of left without thinking. He had been missing for two plus days. And although he didn't come to any harm, he was clearly having a, a mental health episode. You know, it needed to be flagged to mental health services. We were putting a referral form in relation to that, but also concerns about exploitation. Bye, see bye, Gavin. Bye. See you later, Gavin. Thank God for that. When I went missing, uh, absolutely terrified. I didn't know what to do, because nobody would get me a taxi. A friend of mine, who were out to work, and I lent him uh, £2,000, and he won't even pay me a penny back. And £4,000 for a woman for some cars. She took advantage of me like, like he did. I've learnt my lesson, finally. I'm feeling very positive and fantastic. I've just got me mental work again now, helping me keep well. I've been slowly unpacking and tidying up. I've got a good mother. The eight main things in the life family. Now I'm looking forward to the rest of my life.